This is six Lixie displays showing the current time in hours, minutes, and seconds. Uh, it's using NTP time with an ESP8266. Let me reset it here. So it's connecting to my Wi-Fi. We'll give it just a little bit. Okay, it's connected. And that's the current time that it just pulled again. It resyncs every five minutes. Uh, over here at the computer, I've got a WebSockets interface where I can control the color and many other things. So I just set it back to white. This is pure red. Green, cyan, magenta, and of course, a nice orange amber glow of the Nixie tubes that we're going for. And that was over here from the web socket. So I'm going to be opening source on that soon. Uh, the other thing that I've got going is uh, setting a timer, which currently has an error. If I set it for one minute, for some odd reason in my code, this becomes a 1 over here, but we can ignore that side. This is 0 minutes and 52 seconds, so we'll just wait a little bit for that to go. I got in the major big Lixie order today, so got a huge mess on the floor, but I've got the digits all here, big old stacks. And then the actual parts. Just one moment. I've got all sorts of caps, uh, the bases, and I've already got the PCBs in and I've begun assembling those. There's a bunch there, and the remainder of them are in here. So very soon, I'm going to be able to put those up for release. And if you saw a red flash in the corner there, the timer just ended. Let me reset the timer for a little more conservative amount of time. There, three, two, one, boop, boop, boop. That's the timer function. And this is the, uh, I'm calling it Tixie. Tixie is the clock software for these. And right here, it looks a little odd on the page, let me... It's designed to be a Cordova web app, so for Android and iOS, if you want to control your Lixies as a clock, you'll be able to do it through here. And one thing they already do is they automatically pull your time zone as well, so when you have the Tixie code flashed on an ESP and connected to six of these, just turn it on and that's the time. It's done. Which is awesome. So, it's 3 p.m. now and I'm going to get back to work on assembling more of these. So far, they are looking gorgeous and I hope you're all just as excited as I am to see the finished product.